Hello again, Leopard fans, and welcome back to GoLeopards.com. Matt Panto here as we start a new feature highlighting each Patriot League basketball game, and we'll do so to kick things off with one of our assistant coaches for the men's team, and Pat Doherty. And uh, Pat, first off, a great win over Navy, and now we uh, turn our attention to the first road game of the Patriot League season in Army. Yeah, it's great to get that first first league win. Um, I think our guys were really excited. We had a great crowd here. I was really uh, really excited about you know the amount of people that came out and hopefully we can keep it rolling against Army. Let's take a look at the game notes here real quick. Lafayette comes into the game with an 8-10 and overall record, 1-0 and in the Patriot League. Obviously they've won three straight, NJIT, Penn and Navy undefeated in 2013. Seth Hendricks 22 points, 9 rebounds and 9 rebounds, excuse me, against Navy and Pat obviously looking to take that momentum that you had from Navy into the Army game. Yeah, Seth had a, a very good game and we need more from him. Uh, you know, he rebounded the ball exceptionally well in the second half. We need him to continue to do that. Uh, we did not rebound the ball well in the first half. And I think, you know, the guys made a decision to come out and bring some more energy to the to loose balls and rebounds. And we're certainly going to have to do that against Army because those kids, um, just like the Navy kids, I mean, they really get after rebounds and loose balls. They're one of the best rebounding teams in our league, if not the best. You're in charge of the scouting report for this game, so give us the scouting report. Three offensive keys for the Leopards tonight. Well, offensively, we have to look for our transition opportunities. Um, we've gotten into trouble this year when we, we really slow down to a snail's pace and, and don't push the ball when we have a chance to. Um, you know, uh, a big part of that is going to be Tony looking for opportunities to get the ball up the floor, get the ball to shooters in spots where they can score. Um, so that'll be the first key is really, you know, pushing. Coach O'Hanlon talks about pushing and then having patience. We need to push, make sure we get that part down, and then worry about the patience. Um, so that would be key number one. Uh, key number two, we have to play inside out. Army's going to put a lot of pressure on the ball. Um, every time you catch, really any, anywhere you are on the court, they're going to be underneath you, you know, slapping at the ball, pressuring it. And when they get you going side to side, east to west, that's when their defense is really good. So we have to get lane touches. We have to got, have guys penetrating, getting into gaps. We have to get post touches. We have to get the ball down near the basket, collapse their defense, um, and make sure we're just aggressive at the basket. Now what they're really good at is if you drive it out of control, they're very good at stepping in off the help line and taking charges. So we can't be out of control. We need to have you know, a lot of aggression towards the, towards the basket, but at the same time be under control and, and, and you know, ready to make plays that we know we can make. Um, the third key offensively for us, and I just mentioned it a little while ago, you know, Seth gave us a huge boost in the second half against Navy going to the boards, getting second shots. It's an area where we haven't been strong all year. Um, you know, we need more of that from Dan. We need more from Levi, from Seth, from all these guys. When you have an opportunity to go and get us a second shot, you know, those are some of the best shots you can get in a game. So those are be those will be three big keys for us. You take a look at Army. They come in seven and nine overall, zero one in the Patriot League. They actually led Bucknell seventeen to twelve midway through the first half. And obviously, Elliot is one of the best players in the Patriot League, averaging seventeen point three points per game and four rebounds per game. I imagine some of the defensive keys will covering around uh, covering around Ellis. Yeah, well, I mean, they, they run. They run more stuff. They have more sets and hitters than maybe anybody we've played all year. And they really do a good job of putting Ella Ellis in situations where he can be effective. And he's a terrific player. I mean, he's a returning first team all league player. He's shooting it at over 40% from three. Um, really good using shot fakes, getting to the rim. So we've talked a lot about him over the past couple of days. And Army's very good. They had a great plan for Bucknell. Um, they came out and they executed it early which is what allowed them to build up a lead. Um, and they'll have a great plan for us too. They're very well coached. Um, you know, they have a, a, a program where all the kids are bought in. They know what's expected of them. Um, so we have to be just as ready as they are tomorrow night. Give us two more keys, obviously. Uh, covering their sets will be one. Give us two more keys defensively. Well, the thing about Army is, you know, they play as fast or faster than anybody we've played all year. So even when we make shots, they're going to take the ball out of the net, they're going to sprint it up the floor, and if we're jogging back or if we don't see the ball in transition, they're going to get shots up. Um, we've told our guys they have, you know, three or four guys that can have the kind of stat line that Venturini had against us, you know, the kid from Navy. You know, they have a lot of kids who can really shoot the ball, so we have to sprint back in transition, level the ball, and really do a good job IDing their shooters and getting out. That's going to be a huge key to the game. 
Um, the last key I would say is Army is a team that really tests your fundamentals defensively. Um, if you're not in a stance for every second of every defensive possession, they're going to find you. If they see the back of your head, they're going to throw a backdoor pass and lay it in. Um, so we've really talked about our guys about uh, you know, being solid in a stance, seeing both man and ball, because they're such a good screening and cutting team that if, um, if you're the weak link on the court, they're going to find you and, and try to expose you. So th those are two things we've really talked about a lot over the past couple of days. Good luck tomorrow night. We're looking forward to it. All right. Thanks, Matt. Pat Doherty, assistant coach for Lafayette men's basketball team. You can watch tomorrow night's game live on GoLeopards.com and Patriot League All Access. Matt Panto for GoLeopards.com.